Hi, this is question 2 of the AQA Mechanics 1 June 2013 exam paper. Um, for this question we're given the um, graph of how the speed of a cyclist, Hannah, varies as she travels uh, 21 seconds along a straight horizontal road. So we can see that this is a velocity time graph. For the first part we want to find the distance travelled by Hannah in the 21 seconds. Well, because it's a velocity time graph, we want to work out the area under the graph. So um, this has been cut, cut up into three sections for us. So we want to find the area of each of these sections. Now, um, this first part here, um, we've got a trapezium. We've got um, the parallel sides here of length 4 and 5 and then we've got the height or the distance between the parallel sides which is 6 so to work out this one uh, I'll do a plus b divided by 2 so we've got 4 plus 5 divided by 2 um, and times that by the height which is 6 over here I'm going to do the same thing again so I've got a plus b so this time we're going to have 4 and 7 divided by 2 times by the height which this time is going to be the distance between 6 and 14 which is 8 and then finally for this one here um, I've just got a rectangle um, it's got a height of 7 and a width of 7 um, so here we're just going to do 7 times 7 ok so we can work each of these out we've got um, 9 divided by 2 which is 4.5 times by 6 um, which is going to give me 27 over here I've got um, 4 plus 7 which is 11 divided by 2 is 5.5 times by 8 which is going to give me 44 and finally this one here is going to be 49 um, so the um, distance travelled by Hannah in the 21 seconds I've got 27 plus 44 plus 49 um, and that gives me a total of um, 120 meters. Okay, for part B it says find Hannah's average speed during the 21 seconds. Well, she's traveled 120 meters over 21 seconds, so um, her average speed is going to be equal to 120 divided by 21 I should say average speed um, and that's going to be to three significant figures 5.71 meters per second okay I hope you find that useful I'll see you next time